Hey guys, what's up? This is Tony Sager with the Lavender Project, and today we're doing a little bit of a special video. Uh, so today, uh, me and Lexi went to the uh, thrift store, and we found this. Uh, this is a Edison Gold Molded Record. Now, a little bit of history on this. This is a cylinder made of wax, even though it's really made of soap. And inside of here, you have a literally a cylinder made of wax that has the imprints of recordings on them which is basically a record this was a record from the 1870s up until the 1920s um, these were used mostly uh, so we found this I got it for five dollars I'm a personal history fan I love antiques I collect all kinds of antiques especially things related to movies and audio uh, I love old radios, phonographs, records, that kind of thing, so I thought I'd get this. Now, the reason I'm bringing this up is for today's video. Since I bought that, I thought it would be a good idea to show you guys one of the oldest, if not the oldest, and fucking creepiest uh, human recorded voice that, as far as most people know, exists. Uh, it was recorded, I believe, on April 9th of 1860, uh, before the phonograph made by Thomas Edison was made in 1878, I believe, or 79. Um, there was a guy that, I forgot his name, um, but I will put it down in the description, who made something called the phonautograph in 1860, 1859, around that time. Um, so, listen to this. This is the scariest fucking thing I've ever heard, and when I first found this a few years ago, uh, I actually could not listen to it at night because I would legitimately be scared. I would have nightmares. It is that creepy, and that is because, for one, it is played at a speed that is way too quick. Um, it's supposed to be played at 125 hertz, and it's played at 500. Um, and also, um, it's just old and distorted. It was not played for 150 years, so this video that you'll be seeing after I am done talking is going to show you the original, which is scary as fuck, so viewer discretion is advised, especially at nighttime. And it's also going to go through several steps of reconditioning it to the final process of what it's supposed to sound like after it was uh, reconditioned and restored back to the original audio. So check it out, and I think it's pretty cool. The reason I got to throw this on my channel is just because it was a nice tidbit to what I did today and got this thing. And uh, it's also one of the creepiest things I've ever heard, and you know my channel's about scary things. Um, funny enough, I did do this video actually restoring this uh, audio myself about four years ago on my computer. Um, so I was never able to restore it in this uh, quality, so you guys go ahead and watch this and tell me what you think. Um, anyways, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. <laughs>